Are you serious? Are you serious? Well, this horrific, unbelievable, cataclysmic earthquake, 7.9 that hit uh, Nepal. You're looking at the temple, the, the historic uh, temple that was destroyed in this earthquake. Now, this is the third time that this temple has been destroyed. It was destroyed by an earthquake in 1834. It was destroyed by an earthquake in 1934. And now it's been destroyed a third time here in, here in 2015. The earthquake has left now 2,100 people dead, and the number is still climbing. 17 bodies have been found at Mount Everest that were trying to climb the mountain when they went down. And so the chaos continues. Now, one piece of information I think is very important. We've had 55 earthquakes in the last 24 hours. We've had unbelievable aftershocks throughout the region near Nepal, uh, including a 6.7 earthquake aftershock a few hours ago, about four hours ago. Um, we have seen, without question, this 7.9 mega, mega massive earthquake was felt from India to China. So there is certainly uh, a whole lot of definite shaking, quaking, and uh, biblical prophecy being fulfilled in this horrific and the people of Nepal need our prayers I mean this they're still digging people uh, and and many bodies and many of their lost loved ones still buried in the rubble throughout the country this this is a horrible sight it's an awful and they're going to need a lot of help and a lot of prayers the uh, uh, CERN CERN hat happened to be cranked up during the same time that this earthquake happened. Now, did CERN have anything to do with this quake? I don't know. But there wasn't any major solar flares in the three days leading up to this. So there wasn't. it wasn't like there was a lot of pressure coming from the sun, which a lot of times sparks earthquakes. So where did the pressure come from? Not that CERN had to be, you know, these many of these tectonic plates are hanging by a thread anyway. But the fact that CERN was cranked up at the exact same time this earthquake hits forces me to continue to keep an eye on what's going on with CERN. I'm concerned about the CERN, and I have to be, because... Um, this is a situation that's out of control. All right, we're going to continue to keep you up to speed. Thank you for your prayers. I have been very ill. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm struggling. I'll be honest with you. Very ill. But I'm a, I feel like this morning I've turned a little bit, making the turn in the right direction for healing. So I appreciate your prayers. Keep praying for me. And uh, we will be having a broadcast tonight at 7 p.m. Eastern. Uh, my wife Heidi will be helping me. We will be having Sunday Night Live. God bless, and I'll see you a little bit later.